Some of those incidents, beginning with Trump praising supporters who had assaulted uh, a black protester. Oh! Uh, but we've had a couple that were really violent, and the particular one when I said, like to bang them, that was a, uh, a very vicious, very, you know, who's a guy who was swinging very loud and then started swinging at the audience. And you know what? The audience swung back. And I thought it was very, very appropriate. He was swinging, he was hitting people, and the audience hit back. And that's what we need a little bit more of. And what yeah, you we'll talk to you about that later. Yeah, but there's not going to be time. I'm just curious if you okay, have Speak with right Shane, now. please. But you don't. Just. I'm sick and tired of you guys. The you last time you came here, you did the same thing. Get the hell out of here. Jesus. Get the hell out of here. The last guy did the same thing. You were the guardian? Yes, and you just broke my glasses. You the last guy did the same damn thing. You just body slammed me and broke my glasses. But Greg is smart. And by the way, never wrestle him. Do you understand that? Never. Any guy that can do a body slam, he's my kind. Saying we're non violent. I'm saying that fucking we didn't right aggress. Oh, we did not initiate force against anybody. We're That's not right. non violent. We'll fucking kill these people if we have to. <laughs> Well, I do think there's blame. Yes, I think there's blame on both sides. You look at you look at both sides. I think there's blame on both sides. And you also had people that were very fine people on both sides. So just in case you didn't catch all of that, the president praised a Republican candidate who assaulted a journalist as my kind of guy. He said there were, quote, very fine people on both sides when the neo-Nazis, the Klansmen, and Proud Boys um, invaded the city, the great city of Charlottesville, and killed Heather Heyer. And he said that an attack on a black protester at one of his rallies was very, very appropriate. Does that sound familiar? Listen to how President Trump responded when asked about his own conduct on January the 6th. So if you read my speech, and many people have done it, it's been analyzed, and people thought that what I said was totally appropriate. So <clears throat> there the pattern is, staring us in the face. 